Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're going to discuss something not too technical, but definitely makes a huge difference to the appearance of the R36, and that is mirror covers. So these satin chrome, satin silver, whatever you wanted to call it, um, mirrors like this come out on a lot of Audis and a lot of other European cars, and it's honestly, it goes hand in hand with this R36, particularly in black or in a dark color. So we've got lots of anodized aluminium, you've got the roof rails, you've got the big front grille, you've got all of this chrome bits and pieces around the car, some silver highlights here, silver wheels and things like that, but factory body colored mirrors. So you can either choose to pull these off and have them painted. Um, luckily enough though, the aftermarket does have us sorted out with these lovely satin chrome mirrors. So we're gonna fit them up and see how they look. Lucky for us, it's actually one of the easiest things you could ever do to a car, particularly the B6. Uh, so you'll need yourself one of these tools. Now, you can get packets of these off the internet really, really cheap. Like I'm talking two or three dollars for a packet of these. They're, they're called like interior trim removal tools. They're made out of like a heavy duty plastic. It's sort of not really heavy duty, but it's like a softish plastic. Kind of contradicts itself that you can use to wedge in between car, uh, like the interior trims and pieces like that. So you're not actually gonna use a screwdriver or something and break them. Perfect for this because guess what? It's plastic. So it's really, really easy. What you wanna do is find along the uh, mirror where this indicator joins here. You're gonna wedge that in and phew, look at that, straight off. Straight off. That's basically it. All right, so we've got our satin mirror cover. Pop her on, nice and gentle. Look at all of your clips, where everything lines up. Get it in the right position. Now it's basically the same as removal. You need to give it a bit of force to click it in. There's a couple of clips around there. Don't be scared, It's you're not gonna break it, it's, it's designed to sort of click and clip together. So just give it a couple of nice squeezes and that's it, she's on. Literally, that's it, as quickly as it come off. New one's banged on there. Got yourself a nice microfiber or something, just give it a quick wipe over. Being satin, it does get a bit, it's really easy to mark. So just give it a quick clean off and um, we are good to go to some B-roll. Mm -hmm. 